If your Sally eSIM internet is not working on your phone, then in this tutorial, I will guide you on how to resolve this issue. So make sure your phone is connected to Wi-Fi or another mobile data and make sure you have the Sally app. So download the Sally app on the Play Store or App Store. After downloading the app, make sure you have the data. As you can see here, I have mobile data of 1 GB for global. Now make sure the eSIM is installed on your phone. Now on top here, you will see eSIM installed. As you can see, mine is already installed on this device. If you haven't installed it yet, make sure you install it by selecting it here. You'll be able to install it by selecting it here. Now, after installing it on your device, just open your settings on your phone and then select here on connections. And then select here where it is written SIM manager. And then make sure the eSIM is turned on. As you can see, if you turn it off, you'll not be able to connect to the internet. So make sure eSIM is turned on. Come back here. Also select SIM manager again. And make sure mobile data is turned on on so mobile data select for eSIM one so make sure it's selected to eSIM one and then come back here again and then make sure to select here on mobile networks and then make sure data roaming is turned on so make sure data roaming is turned on select on access point names and then make sure to come here to the eSIM side and make sure Sally is selected on the eSIM here on the access point names after that if i turn on mobile data for eSIM you can see mobile data will start working so let me show you when i turn it on so select here on sim manager then mobile data, let me turn it on for eSIM1. And then I'll turn off my Wi-Fi. So let me turn off my Wi-Fi. As you can see, my mobile data for Sally is working and it's connecting to 4G. I can browse to any internet. I can go to YouTube. So let me show you if I go to YouTube. As you can see, it's working. So thank you so much for watching this video and see you next time.